How to convert centimeter to feet and inches in Microsoft Excel. Hello everyone, welcome to Excel 10 tutorial. In this advanced Excel tutorial, I'm going to show you an excellent way that will help you converting centimeter to feet and inches in Microsoft Excel. In a previous tutorial, we have converted inches to feet and inches and in this tutorial, we are going to slightly change that and first we are going to convert from centimeter to inches and then we will follow along the previous tutorial. Let's get started. <laughs> So as I have said, I want to convert centimeter to inches first. So for that, I'm going to use the convert function, right? Equal to convert, double click here. And this is the number. The number is in centimeter. So within double quotation, I'm going to write small letter CM. And then I want to convert it to inches. I can double click here and we have our inches. Okay. Now if I close parenthesis and press enter, so we have centimeter here and we have converted it to inches. Now if I divide it with 12, it will give us feet. Okay. So 5.416. So I don't want any decimal point as we are converting feet first then we will add the inch part so i don't want any remainder inch with decimal point so i want to convert this using the integer formula which is i n t or we can use the trunk function okay so t r u n c trunk here okay it will truncate the decimal point so i'm going to double click here and close this so we have five feet now let's add the feet sign with semicolon so for that i'm going to add an ampersand here and then within double quotation i'm going to add a semicolon that will symbolize the feet okay now if i press enter we have five feet but we haven't got the inch yet so for that i'm going to write another and and i'm going to add a space after the semicolon which i missed so let's remove the and and let me show you how the space part works. So if I click here, if it will have five feet and then it will have an space. When I add the second part, it will have a space in between. The second part will be added to this cell. That's why I'm going to use another ampersand. And now I'm going to write the same convert function to convert that into inch. Okay. So I'm going to write here convert, select the number from unit will be within double quotation small cm two unit will be within double quotation small in okay so total centimeter is now converted now i'm going to add a mod function before the convert so mod function gives us the remainder so if i double click here and here add a comma and the second parameter is the divisor if i divide it with 12 it will give us the remainder inches okay because one feet equal to 12 inch so if i close parenthesis we have five feet five inch and here i'm going to need to use the round off function okay because i don't want any decimal point at the inch part okay so i'm going to use the round function i'm using the round function because it will round up or down based on the number if it's 5.5 it will be six inch okay if it's 5.49 it will be five inch that's why I'm using round function, not round down or round up. Okay. Now, if I add comma, the second parameter is number of digit. I want it to be zero because I don't want any decimal points, but I want the round feature. Okay. Now close parenthesis and I need the inch symbol. That's why I'm using another ampersand. And after that, I'm going to use double quotation twice. This will give us double quotation inside the cell okay if i press enter we have five feet five inch so we have successfully converted centimeter to feet and inches if i drag this and you can see we have successfully converted each centimeter to feet and inches so 165.1 equal to five feet five inches 167.6 equal to five feet six inches so this is how you can convert centimeter to feet and inches in Microsoft Excel. This is what I wanted to show you. Thank you. Thanks for watching. See you in the next tutorial. If you can support the channel through Patreon and for your convenience, I'm going to add the formula in the description for you to copy from there. Thank you. Thanks for watching.